When you hear the Sons of Marshall playing, what memories does it bring back? If you attended Marshall in the early 70s like me, you think of the young thundering herd and the standout basketball teams, especially the 1971-72 team. You remember the electric atmosphere in the Veterans Memorial Fieldhouse, road trips to Ohio U and other Mac schools, and waiting online at Gullickson Hall to get game tickets. Hello, I'm Tony Spinoza. I attended Marshall from 1971 to 75 and witnessed the excitement that was Marshall basketball during my undergraduate years. 2012 marks the 40th anniversary of the 1971-72 basketball team. That squad finished the season with an NCAA tournament bid, a 23-4 overall record, and a final ranking of 12th in the country. That team featured Marshall Hall of Famers Mike D'Antoni, Russell Lee, Randy Knoll, Bill James, and the late Tyrone Collins as its starting five. The team was coached by Carl Tacey and is arguably regarded as the greatest team in Marshall history. I am producing a documentary chronicling that great thundering herd team and the 1971-72 season. This video program will look back on how the team was built, the atmosphere inside the field house, how their success carried through the future teams, and almost as important, how the success of that team helped the community heal from the horrific plane crash in 1970. The story will focus on the players, coaches, administrators, and students from that era getting their recollections of that period in Marshall basketball history. We will catch up on where they are today and how their years at Marshall has affected their lives. We'll dig into archives at Marshall's athletic department, local press outlets, and personal collections for photos and film clips. As the wrecking ball begins the demolition of the Veterans Memorial Fieldhouse, now is the time to focus on that period in Marshall's illustrious basketball history. This documentary is being produced for broadcast on PBS and will be available as a DVD. However, getting this project off the ground and into production will take funding from various sources. I am working to secure corporate and foundation funding, but I need to start a grassroots fundraising campaign to begin shooting interview segments and start research. To begin this process, I need to raise $15,000. Your contributions will help me get this very worthwhile project underway. I have until March 30th, 2012 to raise these funds. No contribution is too small. Please click on the link or go to www.kickstarter.com to help fund this program. Thanks for your support and go herd.